election as the first head of the provisional Confederate government established by the Bluegrass State. Chafing at civilian life while the fighting was escalating, Johnson volunteered his services to the Confederate General Albert Sidney Johnston. Enrolled as an advisor without a uniform, he was later transferred to the staff of Major General John C. Breckinridge, former Vice President of the United States. April 6, 1862, Johnson accompanied Breckinridge to the battlefield at Shiloh, where a horse was shot out from under him early in the struggle. Demanding an opportunity to fight rather than to advise, within hours he had enlisted as a private in the 1st Kentucky Infantry. Private Johnson was struck during his first day of fighting and he died April 9th. Had he known of his unique niche in the story of the Civil War, he would have smiled at the honor of being the only governor to die of Civil War battlefield wounds.